Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Anna Jolene and I'm the author of the Glory MC series as well as the Moonrise Beach series. I'm here to plan my month for October in my memory planner and I'm using the inserts from my shop. Um, they do look like this. I'm actually going to be planning my birthday month. So my birthday is October 19th and that is why I'm going to be using the birthday butterfly kit. This is available in my shop. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what the kit looks like. So you do get a decorative sidebar. I love this fashion girl. I think it's so pretty and I really like the light leaks that are in this kit. Um, it's just one of my favorite elements. I love the rainbows and this kit has all my favorite colors so I'm really excited about it. So this um, fashion girl will go on the side like I have here and my kits do come with four pages for the monthly so you get a Sunday start which does match the inserts from my shop. You guys can also use this kit in the 7x9 Erin Condren planners. So you have the date covers, you have your sets of mini icons, you have some page eight flags. Um, here you can use all the icons on these labels. So you have all four colors and then at the bottom here You actually get some scallop washi which you can use functionally or decoratively And then here we have the full boxes the decorative ones and then you have the functional ones which you can write on You have some half boxes and of course your date numbers and then of course um, You get your functional page which has more boxes bill dues scallop boxes scallop corners page flags and your skinny washi so that is everything that you get in the four page kit plus the free fashion girl and then if you guys want you guys can add on the large monthly scripts so that is what this looks like here and you get the full year's worth of it. So that is what I'm going to be using this month and um, this is how September turned out. I used a kit from my shop called Books and Coffee. I really love this kit. I actually have a vertical kit that matches this as well. So if you guys are interested in that. Um, you guys can check it out in my shop. So I'm going to be pulling out my inserts and these guys are printable. So they're instant gratification and you can print them out as much as you want. And I do have um, different size inserts in my shop as well. So let's get started. Um, I'm excited because it, like I said, it is my birthday month. I'm really excited about using this kit. I've been saving it for this. Um, so instead of doing like a traditional like Halloween spread or even a Thanksgiving spread, we do have Thanksgiving here in Canada in October, which is actually the week before my birthday. I'm going to be doing a light spread because I tend to like lighter colors in general. And since lilac is my favorite color, I wanted to do a kit that has all my favorite colors in it. So I've got my date covers down. I'm going to add my sidebar now. And I'm just going to use the top bit here as a guide to line her up. Perfect. Okay. And then I'm going to grab my date number. So let's get started with putting these down. So my birthday is on the 19th. So it falls on a Wednesday this year, which is a little sad. I, I would love it if it landed on a weekend because that's just easier, you know, if we want to throw a party and things like that. But um, I'm thinking about still doing a get together. At the time when I'm filming this, my birthday is next week. So um, I still have time to decide. Maybe on the actual, like my birthday, we'll do like a dinner and then on the weekend we'll have the party so that more people can attend because I don't know if many people would be available on Wednesday night or if they would be willing to come because I know that I'm going to be inviting some people who are out of town so um, if they want to come and visit you know it is a little bit of a drive so the weekend is just generally better for that. I'm loving this kit. It's definitely my favorite colors. I thought it would be perfect for this month and I'm actually going to be using the matching vertical kit that I have in my shop for the week of my birthday in my memory planner. So it's gonna be really cute. It'll match the spread, which I'm very excited about. If you guys missed my other plan with me my other monthly one in my daily duo. I did do a Halloween one. Um, check out that if you guys 
prefer like Halloween spreads instead. So now that I have all the date numbers down, I am gonna go ahead and use the scallop washi. This comes with a kit, and I'm gonna use this to run across the top here because we do actually have quite a few days that are not included in this month. So this will help me block off those days, and I do have two extra days. So I'm actually going to be using these that come with the kit to block off the rest of those days. So I have the little wax seal one, which I'm really into at the moment. I think they're so cute. And then we have the cupcakes and macarons there. So that will fill up that space there. Um, and then I'm going to go in with all my work events first. So I like to use these larger boxes for those. And I actually have three of them this week. So I'm going to pop the numbers off first. So here I have a sale for Nirvana and more than this. And then on the 18th, I have Resurrection and Drive Me Wild. And then I actually do have another one back to back the following week. So I wasn't able to have a week off in between. I think I'm gonna use the pink here and we'll pop this on the 25th. So that is for Legacy and about that night. Okay, so there we go. Um, and then on the first here, I do have a event. Let me mark that down. Let's use a little bit of pink. And this one is a Halloween event called Scaredy Cat. Don't have anything here on the third. It's actually Drive Me Wild's anniversary. So I think for anniversaries, I'll mark them down with the same type of box. And I think I have some icons that would be good for that. Let's use the little birthday cake. We'll pop that down here. And then I actually do have another Halloween event that is happening on this day. So it would be nice if I can mark that down as well. Maybe I'll just layer it on top like this. And this one is called Howl Bean. Um, and then this weekend is the Pink Planner Sale weekend. So I did offer 20% off in my shop. Let me mark that down with Let's probably use a pink one because it is the pink planner sale. Makes sense, right? And I'm going to grab another icon. And for that, I will probably use the little heart. We'll put that here right on the top. Um, and then we have Canadian Thanksgiving that is happening on this day, on the 10th. So let's mark that down. I'll probably have the day off this day now because I do need to cook Thanksgiving dinner. And then on the 14th, it's my dog's birthday. So I'm gonna mark that down. We'll use blue. I have a really cute kit that I'm excited about using for his birthday. It's like a dog themed kit. It's in my shop, it's called Woof. I've been saving it for this. So I'm gonna use a little party hat for his birthday. Um, and then on the 16th, I have another work event. This one is a fall event. I just zoomed in a bit because I felt like we we're a little bit far. Um, and then the 19th is my birthday. So I'm gonna pull that up. And instead of just writing like birthday there, I'm going to put this full box, so this comes in the kit, it says you're invited to my birthday party. And that way, you know, I'm not going to forget my own birthday, so it's marked down in my planner. It'll be really cute, and I love the butterflies. Um, I do have a renewal this day. So that is for resurrection, so I can't forget about that. Let's mark that down with a larger box. And then on the 28th, I do have um, another anniversary. So let's use this one. This one is for Bad at Love. 
So for that, I'm going to grab one more little birthday cake. Just so that I can kind of celebrate that as well. And I do have these other icons that I want to use and put down. So I'm going to put the to-do list on this day and I do need the alarm clocks. I'm going to add it on this day here and also on this day. So I want to use the skinny washi that comes with the kit to mark down the duration of my book sales. But because I have three this month, I may not actually have enough. So I brought in some washi from Simply Gilded that I'm probably going to be using. So I will run this until Tuesday. And then I will grab the pink one. And we'll use it for the third sale that I have because it matches the box, and I'll use a washi for the other one, I think. That way it kind of spaces it out. So I brought these washies. I don't know if any of these will fit. I was thinking maybe this one, but I also really like this one. And I also kind of want to add something to the top there. Maybe I'll use this one at the top and then this one like throughout the spread. That might be nice. So this one has the really cute hearts and kind of stars pattern. This came in the Stay Golden box from Simply Gilded. So I'm gonna use this to mark down um, Resurrection Drive Me Wild sale. So there we go and then just to kind of top it all off. I'm going to use this one here at the top. And this one's a little bit more simple. It just has the little bows. And this one came from the, I think it's like Home Sweet Home box or something like that. It was like a home themed one. Really cute. I love that box. So there we have it, and then I'm going to add the October script. Typically I would put it here, but because I love the light leak there, I'm not going to cover it up. I'm going to grab it from this sheet and just put it here instead. There we go. Loving it. I do have this extra box here, which I think I'm just going to be putting here. So there we go, now it's not so empty in that corner. And then just to kind of top it all off, I am gonna use the deco sheet that comes with the kit to decorate the last bits. So here is the deco sheet and I'm just gonna be adding the elements here just to decorate it a little bit more. I think I wanna add this little mini dress here on the side because it is a little bit larger. And we'll put the birthday cake next to my own birthday here. And I want to put the balloons here also next to my dog's birthday. For me, the butterflies really make it are some of my favorites. I love this little stemless wine glass as well. So let me pop this back into my planner now and we can see it. So here is the finished spread back into my planner. I really like just the little pops of the foiling there. It's not too much and I really love the color. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little plan with me video for my birthday month. Um, if you guys are interested in the stickers or the printables that I used from my shop, you guys can use the code SAVE10 to save 10% off. And I am gonna be having a sale for my birthday, so 
definitely look forward to that. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye, guys.